morning guys welcome to today's video I don't know if you can see me I don't know I don't know if you can see me but I'm headed down to feed lunch today's mini miracle is Gracie you guys might not know this but Gracie is literally a gift from God holy cow that horse is amazing She's amazing. I love her. I love you too, Willow. Um, when you come to the Day by Day Farm, oh, be nice. You will always be greeted by Gracie. Yeah, I did not close the door because I did not have two hands. A little escape artist is what they are. Hi, Stella Bell. Hello. Yeah, I got hay. Gracie is the kind of horse that comes to greet everybody at the gate. <laughs> She's so cute. Like, I love her beyond belief. Fiona came the other day, and I don't even know if Fiona was super partial to Gracie before we bought her. Um, uh, but Gracie was like, Fiona, it's so good to see you. Come on, wait for me. I'm coming to say hi. And even Fiona was taken by her. Like, she is literally the cutest pony on earth. Like, oh my gosh. She's like a mini me. If she was me in people form, if she was a person, she'd be just like me. Anyway, we are uh, just through some lunch. We're headed out, um, and I don't want them to be hungry while we're gone. Sometimes when I post a video, I'm like so uh, focused on, like the, to me, the video has one specific focus, and then sometimes, you guys pick up on a totally different focus that I'm like so confused about um, but then when I posted yesterday's video you guys were all like Stella and that was the focus of the video for me too so you guys should know that every day we're gonna let Stella out in the field and I'm probably gonna put her out there with Storm and Finn because that's my goal it's just gonna have to happen yeah but not for the whole entire day um, yet until the grass is gone because I don't want to leave her in a muzzle 24 7 she does need time to eat so she'll have breakfast and lunch and then when we go back later I will put her out there and let her run around um, and hopefully we can get all of them out there at some point that is the big ultimate goal Who knows where we are yeah we got heat why why we be cold it is that time of year where we can't come to the trailer. The whole trailer park gets closed up. So yeah, we gotta we gotta pack this thing up. We are last minute people. Like today's the last day that you can do it, or tomorrow is, I guess. Yeah. So uh, one puppy went to its new home. And this little puppy is so good. Uh, she kept us all awake screaming last night till we realized that as long as we don't put her in a crate, she's excellent. <laughs> She controls us, you guys. This little teeny tiny little girl. She's gotten so much better since her sister left, though, hasn't she? Yeah, but she's less playful. Mm -hmm. She's playful. I was thinking about taking our microwave home and putting it in the barn. Then we can always have hot water, cook popcorn. Three and four. I have all of them. Open them all. I didn't get that. We're videoing. Oh, I got a cream. <laughs> oh. oh my god. Oh. Yes. I am flipping these over. 2 a.m. in the car playing my favorite song. It up, windows down, we sing along. The summer night has just begun. The moon is bright, let's have some fun. Oh, this is everything with you right next to me. So alive and tonight I'm thinking that I don't wanna go Wanna go Calling sick in the morning, baby don't leave They don't need to know we're out here wild and free Say we're crazy, it's too much And yeah, we're crazy 
crazy deep in love. This is the trial bag. Oh, no, so, this is what it looks like. Oh, you can't try it? No. $5.99 for a massive bag of pretzels. I say we get it because. Deal! It's a deal! Yeah, it's such a good. We so gotta... You have to carry it though. Okay. Oh, it's heavy too. We got my box of pencils. Let me see. I think they're 99 cents. No, that's not 99 cents. They're cute. Can't see far away with them. Having horses is the craziest life. Or always is something fun and exciting to come home to. Wait, hi Stella Bell. Mom, She's mom, like, get the fence quick. Okay. Go, 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 quick. He's like, my girl. Okay. He's coming. Oh gosh. Watch a storm comes galloping. This Good could get bad. Look how fast the storm is going. How fast is the storm going? Oh my gosh! Storm, be nice! Oh my god, we might have to go get her out. Oh, fine, he's the one running away. I know, I'm nervous. Storm, you be nice. Storm? Storm and Finn. Oh god, we have to get her out maybe. No, mom. Finn's. Because I want them to be together eventually. Storm's on the run. He's like, my girlfriend! I didn't have the muzzle thing when she can defend. Yeah, she can't defend herself, that's right. She kicks. She doesn't bite ever. She bite kicks. Ever. Oh, I'm nervous. They're you fine. See, Do you see Storm putting in his ears? No. I'm stressing everybody out. Finn's making her run. I know. Up Finn. Her, and Finn runs. I know. Finn. Chill, dude. We're not fucking in the fence. Bell's this like, let me in like, Haha, you're trapped. You can't run away. He's like, Finn, you're stealing my girl. Yeah, I don't like it at all. Where's the third wheel? No, Finn is. <laughs> Storm thinks of Stella as his girlfriend. And they are a girlfriend and boyfriend. He's like, yeah. He's like Finn, move! Okay, so the things that make, sometimes when I feel stressed, I have to take Finn out. I have to think about the things that make me feel okay. And the thing that make me feel okay is that A, she has room to run and get away from them. But, and B, Storm gets to go. I don't like her running. Oh my gosh. Storm's excited. Yeah, they're fine. I should check, check with Fiona. Sally's it's just that I just worry about her because of her hawks. Like, I don't want her running like a crazy person. Storm's only crazy because Finn's stealing his girl from him. See? Well, when he pushes Finn to run away, Stella runs. I don't him. even know what I'm videoing here. So you know what you need to do. Take Finn out. He's so fine. Yeah, but Finn needs it. Alright, so... I think we should go and see and make sure that the fence is okay back there. Like, are they in the trees? Are they in the bushes? Yeah. Get out of the bushes! That's the only way that she can eat, probably. She's running for no reason. The reason is that she's excited. girl from me. So All right, so things went a lot better today. They're still like adjusting, but it wasn't so super scary. Gosh, it was so scary for you. It was so super scary. Sam and I are gone to check and see if our shelter is ready again. Like, I want our shelter ready. You know, it's going to be a big, huge learning curve to get it put in our property. Um, definitely ready for it to come. Excited for the horses. Like, our, our horses get excited for each new thing that we do for them. Stella's in love with being in that field. Even though I'm super nervous and freak out putting her in there, I know she needs to be in there and I know she needs to like get used to being with the big horses and stuff and I know she loves it. She loves it. It still makes me nervous because I know Storm can be an idiot sometimes. And for any of you guys who don't understand, I've said it a million times, Storm has always had problems with other horses his whole entire life. His entire history is him being separated and be alone being alone and maybe that's what caused the problem but even when he was at our last barn 
he was beat up really badly and it was because he never stops. He never stops. He, he just, he, there's some kind of thing. He's just not good with his, <laughs> this is his friend. He's good with people. He's good with people. He's just not good with friends. I'm sitting here watching the horses in the car and some people are riding down the road and our horses are all in the grass now. See them? This is everything with you right next to me. So alive and tonight I'm thinking that I don't I'm want... reading up on it because I'm still kind of nervous and Stella can still eat grass. I noticed that she's always in the tall grass at the back. I think it'd probably be easier because she can poke it up that little hole in the end of her muzzle. And she's still a founder risk, so I really don't want her to eat too much grass. So I think I'm just going to leave her out there for an hour and then bring her in. I checked with Fiona. Fiona said it's good for her to be out there, but I definitely don't want her to be getting much grass at all if, if, I, can, if I can prevent it. But I definitely think that she needs to be out there and it's good for her and our shelter's ready and things are changing and I'm excited. I'm excited for things to change. I'm like, I'm so excited for our horses to be horses and be like big together. Poor Stella is always with those little ponies. But yeah, I'm so happy. I missed it, but they're all running like crazy. Side by side. I feel nervous. But she'd be looking good. This is everything. With you right next to me So alive and tonight I'm thinking that I don't wanna go This is everything With you right next to me So alive 